So hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to my channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe and also support my small business at latricelimited.com. So right now I'm actually going to show you guys a video and then I'll get my thoughts and opinions on it as we go. So as you guys have all seen, yes, this video is, you have these people, they said this video was in the UK um, and they're just like pouring milk, cow's milk on the floor in this grocery store. All right. So this is like speaking to power in a way about, you know, just environment and environmentalists um, just talking about how, you know, one, it's not good for the environment, the process to get this milk from the cow to this grocery store right now what you see so a lot of the times you have people who just see oh it's milk okay cool you know it is what it is it just got here okay they don't know the process that goes behind it and they're talking about how expensive and how it is very much detrimental to the environment all right so you also have another point that they are mentioning and that is about how just cow's milk in general is not good uh, you have a lot of people who are saying it's pretty much like the pus of, of a cow um they're saying that humans should not be drinking it um you know if you agree with that then cool if not then i guess cool too i personally can't i don't drink uh just regular cow's milk or anything if i'm having like a bowl of cereal whatever the case may be i get unsweetened vanilla flavored almond milk store brand okay so that's what i personally get but i get what they mean um when they're talking about it and you know it's just speaking to that they were even mentioning oil as well and they were just saying like pretty much this is something that takes a lot of energy to get to this grocery store and really you shouldn't be having it and it also and it also is not good for you now with all that being said <laughs> i don't agree with what they have done um so before i even get into you know some other things that i have i don't agree with what they have done because what you're doing right now you're saying well this is these are my valid points my valid points and you know cool if people agree with it nice um but now you have you're going to be making more enemies because of that and the reason why is because now you have these employees who now have to clean up after you because now you're like oh well, i'm gonna just dump 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 oh look y'all look i'm dumping oh y'all ain't gonna do anything about it. and now you got employees where the boss is gonna say okay employees they made this mess you clean it up and now people are going to be even if they agree with you they're not going to want to support you just because of the way that you went about doing what you do you know what i mean people will be like mm, I, yeah i agree with what they say but this organization not for me because i don't like what you guys did because now it puts more work and puts the burden on me meanwhile you guys get to go off scouts free if you guys don't get arrested i don't know how they do things down there all right so that's one of the things that really bothered me and another thing is the fact that you have people who can't afford i mean you know i mean you got people who are on food stamps you have people who just simply can't afford certain things like that uh maybe they wanted x kind of cereal but x cereal was 10 cent more or 20 cent more and they're like I, I i really would prefer this one but i i gotta get this one because my money is that tight and you have people who are living paycheck to paycheck myself included okay so you have a lot of people out here who were just straight up struggling the asian chick that was in there she was like yeah we've called we uh, sent emails we sent messages and, and this is the way to and i get it i get what you're trying to do but there's a way to go about things and there's a way not to go about things all of this stuff is something that affects everyone not just you not just your group of people that you're in you may say okay alex i know that well one no one thing that you could do have a strike and say we're not buying this stuff say everyone 
don't buy this go buy your almond milk go buy your coconut milk go buy you know your silk uh, whatever whatever it is that you buy buy everything else but this stuff right here tell everyone do not buy this stuff right here and if the support is great for it guess what people won't buy it then and that's how you really put a dent as opposed to all this and now you may have to pay for this so now you just pay for the stuff that you say you don't support you know so that's something that i was like okay what are we doing i have a little post and it's talking about the video that i just put up all right it says okay now folks in the uk who want a plant-based future are doing milk dumps at the grocery store all right they're curious hmm how are you guys thinking about this you know how are you guys going about thinking about what's going on what do you guys think is going to happen all right and this is the video i just showed you someone says as a person who worked retail i would immediately hate them for this this is exactly what i said please go to manufacturers not a random store okay and even if you go to manufacturers the thing about it is your ceo ain't there okay so what are you going to do you know it was equivalent to like those people who were like oh i don't support this so i'm gonna burn my my nfl jerseys and this and that well you had to pay for it you do realize that right you had to pay for it so you're supporting them still just don't support them i don't get why it's not like it, and this is the thing it's not like this is like oil for your car where it's like you have to have this because you know you you have to have it you can't go electric for whatever the reason is maybe you can't trade in your car or you just you got a beat up car or whatever you can't go electric and you have to have the oil i mean you got to have the oil what are you going to do you know you drive a diesel or you own a company with diesel car what are you going to do you know you you got to do what you got to do okay um but milk i mean there's so many different options i get different countries they're a little different with that where they don't have as many options as we do in the u.s but still it's like you could go and get something else <laughs> oh i don't like chocolate candy i hate chocolate candy we'll go get something that's not chocolate you know what i mean oh i don't like cow's milk i hate it we'll go get almond milk or something oh no, no no i want to dump it on the floor come on uh, the same person as you said on this note it would be important to mention that this is a bad way to find support for your cause if you are causing more problems for the worker than the people you are attempting to protest against you are more likely to have a cre uh, have created enemies instead of allies and that is very true another person says as someone who is vegetarian this is very warped spoiling food is not activism if you want to make a point explain the downsides to animal agriculture I don't I didn't become vegetarian by seeing people dump milk but by learning about the industry's ethical issues and that's another thing you know you're telling people oh yeah you know you should be like vegetarian vegan you shouldn't be doing this and hey you may say oh well they're not saying that in the video but people have said that and it's like oh look at how bad meat is oh you're terrible you're terrible you eat meat I can't believe you oh my god oh my god oh my god as I proceed to eat a snicker bar right now in front of you mmm ooh so yummy well you come on dude <laughs> you, know what I mean? you can't tell me that oh well all that food that you eating is terrible for you mmm meanwhile you're eating something bad how about say hey you know they here's the benefits of going blah blah, blah and then leave it at that okay because you have a lot of people who want to force things down people's throat and like you can't change somebody you can't force someone to take something okay so you know i i disagree with all of that it's just the way that they went about it let me know what you guys think in the comments down below and until then